Okay, Ryan Steinelson here with Accelerate Marketing. And have you ever wanted to get a leg up on your competition for local service ads, or at least find out why on God's green earth you are not getting leads? I've had this question from so many clients and so many people that call us, firms, attorney firms, um, anybody else that's using local service ads. Now, what I'm going to show you is our software. And we're using what's called Data Studio. It's just a, a very easy user interface tool that allows us to show data. This is what we use to help our clients do exactly what I just said, to get a leg up on their competition in local service ads in order to really find out what actionable data they can see so that they can take action and do something different in order to get a better outcome, which leads to, or which means really getting more leads. So having said that, this is the software. There's a lot of data down here below. One of the things that I want to point out to you is this phone lead responsiveness. There is actually a formula. Yes, there's a formula in the Google API. It's called phone lead responsiveness. So if that doesn't tell you how important it is for you to answer the phone, I don't know what else will tell you that. That phone lead responsiveness tells you without any question, what is important to Google? It's you answering the phone. So by you answering the phone, the phone lead responsiveness number actually improves and that correlates to more leads going to your firm. What ends up happening really is that you end up getting better rankings. Google actually shows your LSA listing more often and that translates into more phone calls because you're showing as one of the top three on desktop and one of the top two on your phone. Um, by the way, if you really want to pick out a good LSA partner, ask them first if they have access to this data, to the LSA API data or not. If they do not, then I would suggest possibly going with somebody else that can actually give you the data you need to make decisions to show your team, your intake team, for example, that they might not be answering all the phone calls that they think they are. So for this firm, for example, they were swearing up and down, they're answering the phone. In June, you can see that their missed calls actually went down 60.4%. If your missed calls go down one month, then the leads charge or the number of leads you get should go up. And that's exactly what we saw. They went up by 38.1%. Well, what ended up, ended up happening, they got more leads and their intake team couldn't handle them all. And so their missed calls went up by 165.9%. So what do you think is going to happen in the next month in August? Well, the leads went down by 12.9%. So this is what allows you to see that there is indeed a correlation with leads charged or the number of leads you get and the missed calls that you have. And that is actually represented in more precisely in this formula that we keep track of on a daily basis. We recalculate it. And part of the formula is missed calls, but there's other things that, that allow us to identify what this is. So now at least you know that you have the information that can help you make decisions or you can at least you know where to get it. So if you have any questions on what your missed calls are, what they're, how they're trending from your historic data so that you can actually go in and, and pull reports, which is what we do. We connect all of our clients to a call tracking software that then allows us to send reports over to the intake team. We tag all the calls, we listen to them all, and then we send reports over to the intake team of the calls that they did actually miss so they can actually listen to them. And this allows us to very quickly and easily correct any challenges that we have in terms of missed calls moving forward. So we keep the accountability for your intake team or your team that's answering the phone. And this is why on previous videos, I've suggested that you actually get a call answering service in order to make sure that every single phone call is being answered within 15 seconds, by the way, that's the cutoff point. So I hope that makes sense. Let me know if you have any questions. Again, if you want to know why your leads are going up or they're not going up or they're going down or, or you're just not getting more leads, 
Let us know. We can help you. We've got the data that can help you understand what's going on and give you clarity so that you can make good decisions and so that we can hold your team accountable so that they can actually answer more phone calls. And there's more to it than this, but this is the gist of it. So answer your phone, make sure that all the calls are being answered. And if you've got any questions about it and you want to see the data, let us know. Thanks. Bye-bye.